some of the traditional techniques that picture framers use to uh, make composition ornaments. Now, before we dive right in, I've got it out on the, on the uh, bin out the back here. I'll grab my box in and show you a few of the ornaments. Uh, but what we're talking about is how to make the recipe to make the ornament. We will probably press a couple of ornaments today and show you how to um, keep this stuff that uh, I'm going to show you. Gum from a tree. And what they do is they extract the turpentine from that gum and what they're left with is the rosin or the resin and the turpentine. So traditional turpentine that's used for artist paint is extracted and the, use slight, the, the powdered stuff, the, the smaller bits, because I want this to dissolve uh, quickly for you guys today so that we're not waiting around uh, to, to make it all. Now that's probably enough and I'm eyeballing it because I'm thinking, okay, well, what I've got in my pot of glue here I'm going to mix with what I've got in my pot of resin. And this is where it's a little bit of a, um, a strange thing to what you would think. I'm going to bring that wind. oil up to a temperature that um, causes the resin to melt. So we're going to blend that resin and oil back together so that it makes a sort of like a consistency pretty much of say golden syrup when it's done. Um, so again, recipe for you, three quarters of a pound of French glue, half a pint of raw linseed oil. And that's gonna stay reasonably warm for a while. But the whole point of this stuff is that you work it when it's warm and I'll just put that on the floor. A bit more. So it's gonna be quite pliable for a while, but we could let that sit and dry. Often they'll do things when they were making um, let me put it on a piece of wood so I can show you how they would go there. Something would be pushed down and usually Corner. on the wood it's followed by the, the next step that is going to be the, um, the wide piece. We have a, a, a quarter uh, section which is one that would be placed in between the large ones that we put on the end. And then somewhere I've got the other one, I just haven't got it here to show you. And yeah, lots of little bits. Another little one. Pea and sausage. So again, very handy. Things like that, you, could, you can carve something like that up yourself pretty